All right, guys, here I'm going to show you guys how to use the um, offset uh, option with the probing menu. Let's say you, uh, you want to find the center of a, of a block and you're on measuring up from the outside. You want to find the exact center of a, of a square or a rectangular or even a circular part. You can do it using an offset. So basically, let's say you start from this corner and you probe and uh, on the two sides you can say that the set, you can take a measurement of the overall size of your part let's say this part is five inches uh, five and a half inches long by three and a half you could measure that and determine the center to be a two and three quarters and one and three quarters um, so simply by putting it up here in this box and saving that value so I would enter the number at 2.75 as my offset, so that'd be 2.75 this way, heading across, and then I'd enter my other offset because my block is uh, three and a half. Uh, I'd enter it going the other way. So now it's prompting me to say save. So you have to save these settings up here, and uh, once you've done that, now it's gonna when it when it measures here it'll automatically offset the center to be at this location. So let's try that, okay? I've got a block set up, and you can see that I've got the center at two and three quarters because my block overall is uh, five and a half this way and three and a half this way. So by that offset it is gonna measure from the corner, same as we had on the menu. So on the, me on the menu, I probe from this corner and you can do that from any corner, same principle, but you just have to remember the direction. So this way it'd be positive and positive. So if you're up here, you'd be doing negative and positive, and here you'd be negative and negative. So just gotta remember your orientation uh, for your work coordinate. Uh, so here we click on the corner, and uh, it, the probe probes the corner, just like it would normally. And then I go back to the menu, and I hit uh, set X and set Y, and what it's done is updated these DRO values to the to the current one, and using this G92 uh, temporary work offset. So now when I exit probing, and uh, um, And uh, uh, go into the uh, the MDI command. Um, I can raise my probe. Okay, and now I'm going to enter the command to go to to X zero Y zero. And you can see that it's traveled to the center of the part because it's accounted for that offset. So get that right. So basically it's not uh, difficult. It's basically playing with this um, offsets up the top. And uh, with that, with these two offset values, you can find your center. Okay, so it's a little bit of math of dividing the overall length by in half in order to find the center. So hopefully it helps helps you guys out uh, if you have any comments or questions uh, feel 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 free to leave them below and if you like this uh, subscribe okay thanks